just to demonstrate that this is a uh, bug with uh, a replay file that hasn't already been open, I'm going to download a replay file I haven't viewed yet and hit open here. I'm using the new client that is out as of uh, March 29th, 2017. You'll see once we boot into the game here, um, the problem is that the visual displays and the time displays for ability cooldowns uh, is inaccurate when you pause a replay. Uh, when you select a champion, the actual abilities, the passive QR, all of those uh, are misdisplayed because the time keeps lapsing during um, a pause. So if you select Yasuo right now, you see that he's, uh, his ability's on cooldown. I hope he spams it again here. Yeah, right there. So I can hit pause. You can see the ability keeps ticking. Um, I'll skip a bit ahead in the game. That was just to illustrate that it'll happen without skipping in the file anywhere. But if we skip ahead in the game to where people are using a lot of different abilities to illustrate this a lot better. So Yasuo, that's an unfortunate term. Um, we'll select Braum there. So you can see here Braum's abilities keep ticking. Um, this is true for summoners as well, though the uh, icons for summoners um, will actually remain correct in the side, like overlay displays. The uh, icons in the, like, when selected areas will continue to tick. And if we select away from them and come back to them, uh, they're still ticking, they don't reset. And this is true too for if we hit play again. Uh, exhaust is currently at one of three. 100, 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, 94, 3, 2, 1. So even though we um, pause the video, resume the video, select away from the champion, reselect the champion, the uh, miss the miscalculated time from an earlier pause is remembered. This isn't true though if we click away in the video and then click back. So right now, Braum's cooldown is way off track here. Uh, I'm gonna try and click back as accurately as I can. If we go back to hopefully what's the same spot, uh, we can see that the cooldown is actually correct. But this is only when you click to jump. Um, if you use any other sort of pause sequence and then naturally continue the video, the cooldown, uh, the incorrect cooldown trackers remain. Um, again, this is true for uh, the summoner spells, all the abilities, and any status effects. Um, somebody would so kindly step on a cage trap or something. Uh, I guess this will work. Okay, the buffs actually don't work. Who has a stat spec going on? Uh, Braum has a... We can use this. This is a poor example, but this is true. Like with Caitlyn traps, if Nami puts a wave on you and you get Tide Caller's Blessing off of it. So anything from a mastery to an item effect to an ability cooldown. Uh, if you click away and click back, it'll jump the time to where it's reloading again. But even though you remain paused, it's still loading. And again, if you click away, click back, click play, it resets properly, but it otherwise has uh, that carried problem. And if we jump back, so from, hit pause, we see it's ticking improperly, we hit play, it doesn't automatically reset unless we click away and click back then it resets. Um, so just reporting my bug. Hopefully that helps. I want to be able to select the uh, champions when paused just so I can see what was available, what wasn't, when I'm doing analysis to accurately count the plays. So if you could fix that, that'd be great. You guys rock it, right? So I'm sure you'll do it. Thanks. Keep up the great work.